and then we get the jam and pour it into the sterilised jam jars and sell at three pounds a jar. Thank you. Thank you, Lady Christabel, for that most enlightening talk on jam. Right, ladies, this is the uh, last meeting of the WI before the big book night. Ooh. Ooh. Uh, I wish our, our wonderful member, Mrs. Jones, has promised to uh, show us that book she's been going on about for at least three months now. Not hide nor hair of it yet, Mrs. Jones. Yes, uh, the book is all done. Completed, ready to go. Good! Had a lot of time on your hands since he left you, haven't you? Yes. Cats keeping you company, Mrs. Jones! Thank you, Mildred. Yes, they are. And my book is ready and better than anything any of you have ever read. Well, that's lovely. And we look forward to hearing, because if, of course, it's not ready or, or bad, we will, of course, exclude you from every other part of our lives. Oh, God. Um, okay, yeah, yeah. Okay. Books. Yay. Good. Now, ladies, we will sing <laughs> Jerusalem. And in those feet, in ancient times, walk the long England's bow. I always look rubbish after a date. Oh, God. I don't know why I bother. Men are always wankers, aren't they? <laughs> oh, God. I thought you were so nice. But no. Just another weirdo. Bloody online dating, I don't know. Not really sure why I bother, to be honest. Ugh. Look at that. My face on a piece of tissue paper. <laughs> oh, it's really quite depressing, isn't it? Ugh. Oh, yeah. Much healthier this is, isn't it? Naked face, lovely. Right. Time to get out of this ridiculous dress. Ugh. I don't know why I put up with all this nonsense. Pitch me in, glam me up, push up bits. Honestly, it's all a waste. Oh, God. It's like my friends are always saying, Oh, Cindy, you mustn't worry about what men think about you. You're just as lovely by yourself. Yeah, well, you're married, aren't you, twat? <laughs> <laughs> Ha, ha, ha. 
Thanks! <laughs> well, I always wanted, now I don't feel alone! <laughs>
deeply, utterly, irrevocably true. <laughs> Pink fox? Not likely. There again, I did come home with a bow tie. <laughs> <laughs> now, what booty have we acquired? A wedge of money. Mm -hmm. My gambling days are over, it seems. <laughs> or are they? <laughs> Species of the red fox, sir, <laughs> crossed with the white one. <laughs> <laughs> that is definitely intelligent, Dutton. <laughs> Thank you, sir. I try. <laughs> you try very well. Where did you go to school? I went to Eton, sir. Eton? Yes. Then why are you my butler? <laughs> because we can only have one Prime Minister. <laughs> <laughs> Although 
although that hasn't stopped Nick Clegg. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely not mine. <laughs> Was there anything you wanted to... Yes. I want a pink fox. Well, I shall send for one right away, sir. <laughs> All right. I want that particular pink fox. Ha! Ah. I shall go out and fetch it for you, sir. Mm -hmm. Let's we'll see what your eternal education can do for you, ha! Ah. Mm -hmm. No practical use in the real world when you're doing real things like catching pink foxes, is it? I wasn't aware that the real world was concerned with catching pink foxes, sir. <laughs> you really can't, Belvedere. Yes, sir. Oh dear! Oh dear! Yes? What is it? Come in here! <laughs> oh dear. What a lot of it. You look wonderful, is that? Is that lace? <laughs> but of course. You are a clever one, weren't you? That's why I married you. Mm. Actually, no, you just married me because I'm stinking rich. <laughs> you. It's true. <laughs> <laughs> you see those candles on the mantelpiece? Oh, yes, dear. All seven of them. Yes, yes, yes. Arranged in a weird hectacolon type shape. Yes, yes, I know what one of those is. <laughs> <laughs> Hectagon. And most assuredly, you do not. Go and light them all. Light them Clockwise, all. starting at the left, which is your right. Right, oh dear. No, left, which is your right. <laughs> Turns out someone's killed innocence. <laughs> no, 
though we have children running around knowing exactly what their sexual parts are for. <laughs> <laughs> Do you know what it was like? You know, I woke up this morning and my little four-year-old boy came into my room and he said, Hey Dad, I heard you and Mom. Yeah. Can you keep it quiet next time? <laughs> off. Off. So it comes down to someone to catch the culprits that kill innocents. Do you know who that's gonna be? John Smith! From the Justice Department! That's me. <laughs> <laughs> I suppose I better get started on this investigation. Say, goggles, come in. Um, uh, yes, sir. Give me my location, stat. Uh, your location, sir. Yes. Tell me where I am. I'm not really sure. <laughs> <laughs> Hang on. Let me look. Let me look out my window. Um, is that you down there? Oh, oh no, that, that, that's a woman, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it, it's the long hair, sir. Um, uh, uh, Behave me, sir! Oh, no, sorry, sorry. Right, um, let's see. Uh, Google Maps, click and click. Um, <coughs> uh, oh, there you are, sir, there you are. You're, uh, you're, you're, on, you're on a road. Right. <laughs> oh, no, no, sorry, sorry. Um, yes, I'm, I'm trying to read the, uh, the, the road sign. Um, it says that you are on uh, uh, Clifton Road. Cl Clifton Road, that's it, yes. Clifton Road? Yes, that's what I said, sir. I wish I knew my way around Beeston. <laughs> well, if you like, I can just sort of send you Google Maps using my iPhone, sir. Well, that'll be... That'll be Really good. Thanks, Goggles. Oh, isn't technology amazing, sir? Yes. Isn't, isn't it amazing that you can send Google Maps now? They used to have to do that by horse. <laughs> <laughs> Terrible days. Terrible days. Yes. They truly were. But anyway, <laughs> here we go. What, what's your email address, sir? Um, John Smith at JustThisIsAwesome.com <laughs> Oh my god, were you the first John Smith to register? Absolutely. <laughs> Did you see I'm Bunnies for Money 978? <laughs> because there were 977 people before me who wanted that <laughs> good... <laughs> Sending it, sir. Thanks, Goggles. I may need some technical updates later, but for the moment, over and out. Bye. <laughs> Man, Goggles is the tech guy. Couldn't live without him. <laughs> He's just not hero material, you know? Don't want him cramped in my style. Hmm. Oh shit. He sent me the Apple version. <laughs> now I don't know where I am. <laughs> I'll just have to ask someone who just wish there was someone convenient nearby. You! Not the most polite way to greet a stranger, but okay. <laughs> Tell me, where am I? Jesus Christ, you have no manners. Well, innocence is dead, lady! If you don't tell me where I are... Where I are? Where we are. Wait. We are. You are. No, I was thinking about something else. I'll, uh, I'll delete that bit. <laughs> if you don't tell me where I am, justice can never be served. Wait! He gets out his cattle prod! <laughs> Dude, you Americans are so... Whoa! Jesus! Tell me! Tell me! Cows! <laughs> Ow! I'm calling police on you, you're assaulting me! I am the police! Justice Department! <laughs> You're the Justice Department of the Police! <laughs> yes, I am, lady. Wait! He puts away his cap and prod and takes out his toaster! What? <laughs> <laughs> Thank 
Thank goodness there's a socket on the floor. <laughs> <laughs> someone who was going to kill innocents, where would I go? The university campus, of course! <laughs> Pop! Damn. Take that, fiend! Now I've got crumbs in my hair! You're a weird police officer! It's the only way we can get stuff done these days. Otherwise you have to go through court. <laughs> So rather than using, you know, intelligence, you use toasters. Wait! And a crate of laps! <laughs> <laughs> what the hell is going on today? Am I on camera? Is this being filmed? What the hell? You just got a crate of lamps out of your back pocket. <laughs> I'll turn these on, and then when the light bulbs get very, very, very hot, then you'll be sorry, lady. <laughs> because then this dimly lit street in winter will be brighter? Yes. And then I'll push your face onto them. <laughs> <laughs> They've got no shades! <laughs> <laughs> that raw light bulb energy will be hitting your face. Your skin will roast. And then you'll give me... Actually, you've pretty much given me all the information I need. I'm heading to the university campus. Look after these lights. What? <laughs> who's gonna read this book? Who's, who's gonna read it when it comes out? Who's gonna be inspired by it? I, I need to know, I want to know. I want to know what people will think about it. I wonder what, I wonder what Gandhi thought would think about this book. <laughs> <laughs> with these muppets, oh, but he is quite a character nonetheless. I don't know what's going to happen next. 
I'm imagining there's going to be some sort of showdown with, with weaponry. Hmm? Maybe? Maybe in some sort of a university park campus, perhaps, for chancing. Eh? <laughs> um, let me just uh, see where... Oh, by the way, it is great to be doing this speech here in uh, Nottingham! Hey! Hey, you are there! Oh, just joshing you. Yeah. Oh, hang on. I see some more adoring fans heading my way. So you're 
saying whether you think you should get this gun because you're more deserving. Yeah, I'd say I have a worse life. Really? Want to make something of it? Maybe. <laughs> Stop pointing the gun at me. Stop pointing your gun at the floor in my direction. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know this gun leans slightly to the left. So really, this is pointing directly at your place. <laughs> Give me the gun. And what if I don't? You're probably going to shoot me. Stupid question. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Woman, then. Oi! Oi! And 
and she shot him right between the eyes. You lie! You no, lie! No way! Right in yeah. between his two peg eyes, peg eyes! <laughs> no! No, not the captain! I'm sorry! You be lying! I wish I weren't lying, peg eyes! You be lying first, mate! Where are you guys? <laughs> Over here, follow the sound of my voice! You're lying! <laughs> Guys, I brought his body with me. <laughs> He's over there still, right? No. Oh no! Come! No! Come! It's too late, peg leg and peg face. I didn't even knock his hat on. Look, I think it's time we give him a burial at sea. Aye, aye! Why are you? You captain! <laughs> <laughs> He's in the water now! <laughs> so long, Captain Neckbeard! So long, Captain Neckbeard! So long! Captain Neckbeard! So graceful in death! <laughs> <laughs> Oi! Come on, lads! <laughs> I don't want to see this anymore. Wait, wait. It's gonna be first mate now. No! <laughs> <laughs> Listening in. Sorry, I won't. I won't. I won't, I won't um, try and interrupt. Sorry, girls. I'll just watch. <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry. I wasn't actually a Swedish man in a fess. You know what? I was doubting it. <laughs> I'm actually John Smith from the Justice Department. Wow. <laughs> wow. <laughs> there appear to be two guns on the floor. Using my incredible detective capabilities. I figured out that it was probably one of those two guns that shot you. Am I right? Well, actually, <laughs> it was a third gun. A twist! I like it. <laughs> you see, I was just, um, taking my guns for a walk. Yeah, I do it all the time. Yeah. And, um, I came across this girl in the park. I've never seen her before. Her name was Cynthia. <laughs> How do you she, know her name? She looked really like a Cynthia. Good excuse. <laughs> and I said to her, hey, you know, I've always been an outstanding member of society. You've never done anything wrong, never killed a man or innocence or anything bad like that. And she said, aha! You see, I have. And then she shot me for no reason. You'll know her, she looks a bit fat. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on, I've got it on a business card. 
Make your way to me. <laughs> I've been shot. I don't care. I'm the hero. <laughs> Oh, oh, right, right. I am losing quite a lot of blood. Do you mind? <laughs> Doing just this thing. <laughs> Scanned. Um, <laughs> it's at the address that I'm faxing to you now, sir. <laughs> Good job I've got a fax machine in my back pocket. <laughs> I still need to get my eyebrows done. <laughs> uh, 
Yeah. Oh yeah, emotional turmoil. Nearly killed my friend. Awkward. <laughs> Trouble is I just I kind of don't really care because she has everything. She has everything I want. Gotta find a way in. Can't knock at the door. She'll be expecting. Is this someone at my door? <laughs>
Sorry. <laughs> <sighs> the Lord will be pleased. Oh. My Lord! Yeah. Didn't. I was there for 
I hate those two. Their book choices are rubbish. <laughs> <laughs> Dad, the wrong dad's <laughs> 